When Marty McFly travelled back to the future in 1989, he arrived at the 21st of October 2015 and was greeted by flying cars and self-tying trainers. As that date became a reality, the actor who played Marty, Michael J. Fox, may not have been greeted by hovering skateboards, but he was certainly greeted with a lot of excitement as hundreds of fans gathered to celebrate the film. It's like the Pope's visit. It was, it was, and I, and I, the only similarities I brought to the Pope, not to compare myself to the Pope, but, I, but, but it's been busy. It's been just one thing after another. Um, because people want to mark this. And they, and they, want to, they, want to, they want to take note of it because the movies have meant something to them. And, 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 and when you're involved with something like that, that's just uh, so humbling. It's such a privilege. And, and, um, and I never, I, I, I don't know that I ever thought that it would be like this 30 years out. The cast of the cult movie gathered on the significant date from the second instalment of the trilogy to mark 30 years since the release of the original Back to the Future film. And after three decades, Michael says he's still surprised by the cult following the film has. I think that it just speaks to, to, to different generations in different ways. And, and, and what we didn't know was it would speak to a generation further than how far we reached in the movie. We, we thought it would speak to, 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 to the 50s generation and the 80s generation. We know it would speak to the 90s generation and, 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 and the 21st century generation. Uh, so it just, it's just, been, it just kind of it continues to amaze us. Christopher Lloyd, who played the mad genius inventor, Doc Brown, says he still feels fortunate to have been part of the franchise. Uh, it's, it's a dream come true to be in a film that has the, the kind of profound impact it's had on so many people, uh, kids and, and adults, and, yeah. be, and for it to endure the way this film has. It's amazing, you know, it's, it's, it's a rarity. So I'm, I'm really count myself fortunate to be part of it. And Leah Thompson, who played Marty McFly's mum, also made an appearance at the event in New York and was happy to mark this special anniversary. You know what? I mean, if people want to celebrate, I'd love to celebrate with them. Well, who should I be to be, like, crabby about? Oh, gee, everybody wants to celebrate a movie I did. So, yeah, I'm just, like, really excited that people are enjoying the movies, that they're seeing them, that they have a chance to see them again and share them with their families. So although not all of the crazy technologies shown in the film have become a reality, one thing that is definitely for real is the cult following which the film has built up over the years. And although executive producers say a fourth instalment of the franchise looks unlikely, you never know what will happen in the future.